Welcome to EdTech Hustle. Today I'm going to show you a study tip using Notebook LM that's going to help you learn from longer YouTube videos without actually watching them. Have you ever scrolled YouTube and found these really long videos, usually interviews that are one, two, three, maybe even four hours? Here's an example of one, Sam Altman with Lex Friedman, and you can see some of the topics that he talks about. Luckily, they labeled it in the title. They also set up chapters for us, which is nice, but you know, I still don't want to go in and watch that chapter. So for instance, let's say I want to learn what Sam said about Elon Musk. I can find the Elon Musk chapter that's in here right over here but what if he references Musk at a different part I'm going to completely miss that so I'm going to show you how you can use notebook LM to make that process easier all right so check this out notebook LM just got a facelift a brand new logo a brand new website that shows you some of the features that are available on this really cool platform it's no longer experimental it's an actual regular platform so you can find it at notebook.google.com all right so i just started a brand new notebook and one of the things that you can add are youtube videos now i've talked a lot about this in different videos i'm going to leave the link to this playlist in the top right hand side but i want to show you i'm just going to go back to youtube and from here i'm just going to click share and i'm going to copy this link all right, we're right back here in Notebook LM. I'm going to click on that URL for YouTube and I am going to paste that URL and you'll see that that video is now one of my sources in the left-hand side. So in just maybe 10 seconds, this program was able to bring that video. When I click on it, I can now see a full transcript as well. So if you need a transcript of a video that's not available on YouTube, this might be one way to do it. I can also see a summary that we're looking at right over here as well as some key topics. Now, I should this in other videos as well, but you can do things like generate a briefing document, table of contents, that sort of thing. So this is awesome. So I now have a resource where I can view information on this particular video. So I can start by asking it a question and it's going to give me an answer based on the transcript of this video. All right, so my question is this, what did Sam say about Elon? And just like ChatGPT, this has that conversational interface, almost like sending a text message. And Notebook LM is then going to scan this transcript and find the points in the video where Sam had talked about Elon where Sam had talked about Elon Musk. You can see some of the points that are right up here. So this is awesome. And the nice thing about this is you can see that it leaves these little uh, references right here. So I can select on seven and it's now going to jump directly to that part of the transcript where the, that particular reference was made about Elon Musk. All right, you can see that there's some other questions in here as well. So now I can just mention something. I can now say, when will open AI create AGI, artificial general intelligence, right? So in the past, I'd probably have to either watch the video, maybe scan a transcript, but now with Notebook LM, I can just ask it any question and get those answers back almost instantly. So the first thing it says that Sam doesn't provide a concrete timeline for OpenAI's creation of AGI, of course, but it does say what Sam discussed about AGI and the places in the transcript where I can then find that. And this is just really the tip of the iceberg because I just showed you how to ask questions and how to interact with information from one video. But what I can do is click this source button and I can add a number of different sources, everything from PDF files, text files, MP3s. So you can add websites, other YouTube videos and content from your Google Drive. So this really is a great study tool. But what I like to use it for is to find information about some of those longer YouTube videos that I'm probably never going to have time to sit through and watch. So you can check it out at notebooklm.google.com. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions on Notebook LM, go ahead and leave them in the comment area below. So thank you for watching and have a great day.